Well, welcome back to God of War, Ghost of Sparta. We've already gotten to the secret chest. I'm thinking, uh, okay, we don't jump off. Oh man, we really fucked things up. Okay. Really wasn't planning on doing that. Okay, so that, that piece that was right there is gone now. Now we can open that wall. Hold it, goddammit. We're full on health, so we're not gonna take that chest. We might need it. We need 8550. And the other things you can upgrade, you have Atlantis, 4,500 more damage and duration. There has been increased fire damage, regeneration improved here. And there's three more things. One is the shield and spear, the Spartan shield and spear. But we always go for, for the blades first. You use them the most, so. Oh fuck, I missed it. Well, I was doing a fucking combo, man. Fuck, I was trying to dodge. Holy shit. When they stagger you into those animations, you're done. There's not much you can do. That was a close one. It's fucking birds, man. Fuck you up. So annoying. Oh, well, I like the white one, but we need the health. That's why you need damage. That was, that was close. Didn't actually like how close it was. Kinda glitched there for a second. If you saw that. I'm, um, I'm in an invincible animation, can't get me, can't damage me, you die in one hit. Boom. That's what you want to do. Can you imagine? This thing ran on the PSP like a champion she was crazy
Too bad I can't go fast. Gotta go fast! Would have been nice. God of War 3 can do that. Okay. Just making sure. Kratos sure likes to destroy shit. Because that's his forte. He's good at it. Why not indulge? There's nothing else. Got some red orbs. I'm close to it. I think the blades are going up to level 5. I could be mistaken, right? I don't remember every little detail of the game. Just judging from the other God of War games, the blades usually go to 5. The magic stuff go to 3. Fuck off me. Give me the orbs. Give me the orbs. Fucked. Fucking thought, bitch. Fucking thought, bitch. Yeah. How'd you like that? Oh, you screwed. Yeah, puns for days. Fucking screw, bitch. Screw you. Do we go up or down? Oh, we definitely go up. Motherfuckers. Just, just fucking die. Let me open my chest in peace. Little bastards. And this don't fuck trying to eat me all every fucking five minutes. That's what you get. You see a piece of tutorial? That means that's that's the right way to go. So you go the opposite way. Some crazy shit. Poof. 
I think I got a last fucking second. Look at him go! The cinematics of this game are very different from both Chains of Olympus and God of War 1. Kind of like has a, a different light to it, a different, a grittier, darker style if you would. like. More, there are more grays. The angles are a bit different. You can tell it's different. Atlantis was sinking. But that mattered little to the ghost of Sparta. Oh uh, yeah, right. I don't give a shit about Atlantis. It's supposed to sink. It's supposed to be the lost city. Why should I give a shit? The wretched thing shouldn't have attacked me first, right? It's not my fault, it's dumb as shit. I need to get there. To that chest. So we're gonna we're gonna save. And we're gonna try to get there. See? I can see that it's there, so I'm going for it. How you doing? I'm not gonna kill him. I don't have to. He's gonna die either way. I know the Kratos is an asshole, but... Why kill someone that is already at the brink of death? Right? You would say, well, put them out of their misery. Well, then it's gonna be my fault. They're gonna die either way. Right? Just let them die the way they choose. Like, give them a chance, right? And see, that that's not me. That's not my fault. These guys are not with me. I hate these fuckers. You cannot interrupt those attacks. Fuck you. I was not trying to grab. I was not trying to grab him. I really wasn't aiming for him. Fuck you. You have to press. Have to anticipate when they're gonna attack you. And uh, press your block before they jump on you. It's a real shitty mechanic. I really don't like it, but... It's the same as anything else. Why do you have to give me those dumb tutorials? Can move from the side, okay. Oh, the rope fights. I love those. So annoying. 
for some reason they're always annoying. So you just grab them. And usually they would come from both sides, but I guess the PSP has its limitations. See, when they get you in that animation... There's no way to block inside of it. They get you in the animation, you cannot block in the middle of it. Or if there's another one coming your way. I don't know why they decided it's a good idea. It's just dumb. Now you think I'm gonna miss this box? No way. I don't know if they respawn, so... Fuck! I don't think they'll die soon. Might have to just go up and... Beat their ass. See, a lot of people that play God of War for the first time tend to fall in this, but it, it, it doesn't work. Making sure that there are no secrets behind me. really change the camera angle so I don't know if I missed something see this is what I love to see when they just give them to you Surprise? My brother lives. He lives. Don't say nothing, bitch. Don't let your rage blind you, Kratos. There is much you do not know. Be warned. They will all try to stop me. The 
as he said in God of War 3, when Poseidon told him that God after God will deny him. You know what he said? They will fall as well. And he's right. No one's gonna stand in my way. You don't have to teach me how to climb a rope. Okay, so you have to rotate manually in order to jump. He doesn't jump in the direction you point him. Oh well. Is I was implemented at a later stage. Those footsteps. Do we need any of this? Don't think so. Ow. That wasn't very smart. I don't think. I wonder if I don't kick him into the machine, can I just kill him for red orbs? What the fuck? After a while of killing these, uh, it stopped giving me red orbs, so... No, that doesn't work. You can't just farm them. They keep respawning, but they stop dropping blood orb, um, ra red orbs. I mean, which is well, there's a lot of tactics to God of War. Farming red orbs and stuff. Almost every God of War game has it. Some speedrun tricks to pass certain sections without having to go through a huge ordeal and just quickly get through it. Should we continue a little bit further before we end this? You know what? This seems like a better spot after the chest, so I hope you all enjoyed it so far. You're enjoying the game and the videos. If you do, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on new videos. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and a comment. And I hope I catch you all in the next one.